for me, what was what was so fascinating about that is really uh, trying to capture the beauty in growing old because we live in a world that's so consumed with youth and vanity. It's it's um, it's easy to lose sight of the fact that um, there's a real beauty in growing old with someone. And uh, I just hadn't seen that before, and I really, really fell in love with that idea and 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 wanted to tell that story. Um, so for me, that was that was the big hook. Adeline, as I mentioned, you know, young woman or seemingly a young woman um, who has this accident in in the late twenties and uh, is rendered ageless, somewhat mysteriously. She's not sure why, and and has to live through the twentieth century um, with this you know, affliction, as it were. Uh, and and as a result, um, she realizes that she has to sort of live life on on um, on the lam a bit. Uh, in the fifties, she's uh, chased down by the FBI and and the police, who start to sense something is wrong with her, and and think that maybe she could be a curiosity or um, a specimen for the government. And as a result, she kind of goes on the run, and and she has to live a very quiet life, a very small footprint. Uh, isn't close to a lot of people, both because she's on the run and also because uh, she's found that as she um, grows older, people die away, she carries on. So so the blessing is, is of course, that um, she is, is uh, forever young. She, she, she's beautiful forever, and, and at the same time, she, she's accrued you know, the knowledge that one would if they had a sharp, uh, agile mind for over 100 years, which she does. For Adeline, being born in 1908, we wanted to kind of, we wanted to have an understanding of what a woman from that came of age in the 20s and 30s would sound like, and so we we started there and, and tried to, you know, design her to be, um, design her to be someone who is you you feel right away that they carry themselves with this um, a posture that women today tend not to, and it's not good, bad, or otherwise. It's just it's just different. 